see what you can line in here. Once again, son. Once again, homie. And today I got another little Funko unboxing for you, Fuse. Which today I had to go with this Black Light 2 pack. Which I know I mentioned in the past, say, eh, that I got tired of freaking seeing these Black Light freaking pops, eh? Because Funko's getting carried away. So, tampas on la verga, eh? They Black Lighting everything, man. Which they need to slow down, eh? They need to limit this Black Light theme already, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Estuvo bueno, Funko. Ya, bájale, bájale, eh? But either way, man, I couldn't freaking pass on this 2 pack, man. First of all, man, it has my second favorite spot. Spider-Man in here, and it has a new freaking uh, character that I haven't seen made into a pop. I know they made a comment one of Spider-Man India, but this black light one looks freaking dope, eh? I like that fool's costume, eh? Which, uh, Spider-Man 299, if you guys don't know, I know I already said it, but he's actually my very second Spider-Man. My third has to be Miles Morales. And this, uh, two-pack is actually from the new Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse, or Across the Spider-Verse, which, by the way, I haven't even seen the movie. I've seen, like, the beginning clip where uh, Miles meets Spot, but that's pretty much it when they're like in the convenience store. But I need to watch that movie. I've been slacking on watching these movies. Like the Flash movie, I just recently saw Iron Man. And the Blue Beetle, I still need to go and watch it. I heard it was a great, great movie. Even though, I guess it kind of, what is it, bombed on the box office. Which, come on, man, support DC. What's going on with you fools? Which, by the way, have you guys seen the new Aquaman uh, trailer? Oh, Black Man to the King Dope, eh? But uh, without, without further ado, I'm going on, I'm jumping off topic, eh? But without further ado, man, if you guys ain't familiar with Spider-Man, uh, 2099, his real name is Miguel Herrera, and then, you know, I gotta support that fool, because that fool's Raza, well, half Raza, he's, uh, he's half Mexican and half Irish, homie, so you know that fool likes throw putazos, eh, and his first appearance was in, uh, what people say, you know, a lot of people have little mixed feelings about what went his first appearances, some people say his first appearance was in Amazing Spider-Man 365, but technically it's not, man, because we just see him, a little picture of him, which, I don't know what you call that, like the preview, but his first appearance was in Amazing Spider-Man issue number one. Uh, I mean, Spider-Man 2099 issue number one, which was released in 1992. And then uh, Spider-Man India, his first appearance was in uh, Spider-Man India, what is it, 2004, right? Eh? But yeah, man, I really like freaking uh, Spider-Man 2099. Not just because he's Mexican, but it just his outfit looks dope, man. He has totally different superpowers than uh, Spider-Man. He's a little bit quicker than Spider-Man, which the only thing that does suck that this Spider-Man doesn't have that Peter Parker and Miles have is that the Spidey Sensei. Eh? But besides that, this was a dope character, man. He even has bangs. He has venom in his bangs that will bite you, homie. So be careful, eh? But uh, yeah, man, this was a dope character. Spider-Man to uh, India, he's all right, man. I just like his outfit, man. I don't know. They kind of switched it up from... Um, his comic book, I'll put an image of him, how it looks in the comic books from how they made him look in the cartoon name. But, uh, yeah, man, I'll show you real quick. Did you see Spider-Man 2099 and then Spider-Man India? The top. That's the side. And that's the back, eh? which is pretty dope, eh? So let me unbox this beauty right now and show you guys. Let me know which Spider-Man is your favorite Spider-Man. I know everybody's going to say Peter Parker, but besides Peter Parker, you know? That's right. Eh? Oh, man. Look at this beauty, man. Oh, this one looks dope. And I like how he looks in the second movie. In the first movie, he looked kind of scrawny, right? Like, kind of scrawny. Now he looks kind of bulky. That's what we hit in the gym, man. But, yeah, look at him. Nice little detail. And, by the way, happy uh, Mexican Independence Day. I don't know whenever I drop this video or whatever, whenever I edit it, I'm freaking... Either way, happy Independence Day. Eh? And then, um, let me show you guys freaking... I like how they went with the freaking orange and the purple on this fool. Oh, I know for a minute it kind of remind me of freaking uh, Stacy Quinn eh, with the hair to the side, eh? No? Or am I just sure? Which I really wanted to get the spot when the popping tea, but they didn't have my size, eh? Because, you know, I ain't tortas as bad. I was super lucky tortas, I think, but, you know, I ain't tortas as, as I used to be. So, they only had a bunch of two X's, eh? So, I, I passed on it. Because I usually, when I get the popping tea bundles, unless I, it's a character that I really, really like, I won't open the popping tea. I just leave it in the box, eh? But, like, that one, I would have rocked the tea. Because it's, what is it, Spot and Spider-Man fighting? 
a Miles, whatever, would be pretty dope. But this one's dope, man. I like this. I'm gonna have to go watch this movie, man. I heard it was great. Shout out to Sony eh, for doing a great job on these animated movies. Well, yeah, man. Let me know what you guys think, eh? Did you guys end up copying this? I don't even know when these released. Eh? I just went to Target and I went to the Funko section and then they had all this new stuff eh, that I haven't even seen. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you guys this quick little uh, little pickup I did today, man. They're pretty dope, man. I give these... I give these like a... Like 8.5 out of 10, eh? Because I know they're going to continue doing a gang of freaking Spider-Man 29.9 pops. Eh? I know they released already what... Like two different ones already, like the exclusive one, another Glow Entertainment Earth exclusive one, if I'm not mistaken, and the Con exclusive, right? And they already had the Walgreens ones, and um, what was it, the ECC one, which where he's kind of had a different little pose, which that one was dope. But yeah, man, let me know what you guys think about these, eh? And then once again, man, I enjoyed this video, man. Um, you guys enjoy Funko Pop unboxings like this, and then um, like Funko Hunts, which I haven't done a Funko Hunt in a minute, eh? I know I mentioned this on, I don't know if I already dropped the other video of the ba Batman Rewind or whatnot, but I will be doing a Funko Hunt pretty soon, and I do need to get back on the Mystery Box unboxings, eh? I know a lot of fools been asking me, when are you gonna do the Mystery Boxes, eh? I like your reaction, because I'm like, yeah, well, don't even trip on me, I got you. But uh, yeah, man, uh, if, uh, I'm, I'm trying to get back, homie, on this YouTube thing, eh? But uh, yeah, man, uh, like always, man, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on IG, at streak underscore 89er, and like always, streak 89er, out, play.